What's going on guys, it's Light here, and welcome back to another YouTube video, and today I am playing The Legends of the Wind Waker, but you're probably wondering why the heck I'm even on this game. For those who remember, I used to stream this game and stuff, but I had to save and stuff on my other console. But, we are here, on well, this game, because I'm looking for a location called Two Eye Reef, right? Because that's where a big Octo is at that I need to go find so I can get the Great Fairy. So I've been struggling trying to figure out where the heck the guy's at, so I'm like, you know what, let me just go ahead and just go look it up on YouTube. No, or not YouTube, let me just go look it up on Google and figure out where the freak this thing is at. And now I gotta figure out, out of all this entirety of this map, where the freak Two Eye Reef is at. That's Three Eye Reef. Okay, so Two Eye Reef has to be back the other way at which, at which I came. Oh no, I probably should have just continued looking up on the the uh the, the things and such because I uh I, I I honestly do not remember. I need to f wait, why is there sharks after me already? But anyways, I'm like actually gonna try to head for this location to find this dude at and we're trying to find some more big octos and just fight them, you know? There's, there's nothing else to this video, that's it. So if you don't want to stay here, then leave. I don't really know what else to say. Like, I just had some things coming up and stuff like that that, that you know, that, that I want to put my attention to. Anyways, I'll see you guys when I get there. And there's the big old tornado thing. It's funny, I can get the hero's bow here very, very soon to situate that, to be able to teleport around. I still want to 100% complete this game, since this is one of the things I have not done. Oh boy. I can't even tell how close that thing is and does it actually start pushing towards you when you're on a boat. I can never tell what those when it comes out to those cyclones. I think it's terrifying. But anyways, I uh, one thing I want to state, you guys probably already noticed and such that like I have a texture pack installed with this good old game of the Wind Waker GameCube edition. And I'm not gonna lie, I like it. I have a freaking blue tunic. Like, look at me, look at me. I'm not even doing any actual editing here. I'm just using the actual camera in the game. I have a blue tunic. It matches with the water, kind of. It's super cool. And I also up everything upon its resolution to 4K. I think that's the ice island down there as well, too. I recognize those little spikies anywhere. And that's a uh, fairy found as well, too. I... Don't I don't th think I don't think I could do anything with that one. Is this two eye reef? I mean, this could be two eye reef. If this, hang on, let me look around. All I know is that I feel like you know if 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 it's three and then like four is up here, the five eye reef is probably like up here somewhere. Two eye reef could be down here, or this could be one eye reef. And I think this is two eye reef, if I'm not mistaken. When I uh, came over here before. I just can't remember where the giant octo is at. You know, he is a dead giveaway too. The guy with the uh. Yeah, he's the one who's gonna help with this. When you see him with the telescope, he's the one who's- Yeah, I think I see it. Yep, that, that's where all the birds are at. Yep, that's where all the seagulls are at, right there. That's crazy. That guy is such a very helpful NPC. He just sits there and actually looks. People get insulted for being an NPC, but then you have NPCs like that. It's like, he helps you. And he, you know, I saw him earlier over here in this square on the Horseshoe Island. He was looking at something, but I just don't know where the seagulls are at. Usually, he's looking at some type of object or something at a distance. So now we're gonna fight this guy. All right, come on. Get me a little closer. I know the, the current's going against me, but this... Yep, here it is, here it is, here it is, here it is. There we go. There we go. See, I'm about to use the cannon. That's all I'm about to do. I'm about to... I'm used, oh, you don't even have a lot of eyes. You only have three on that side. The fact I gotta aim with this, like, it's actually a lot more difficult to have to use the cannon and such if you're not used to how it shoots. And I'm not saying I'm any good. I mean, heck, you've already seen that I'm missing a lot of my shots right now. Just come on, hit him in the eye. Hit him in the eye. Thank you. There's one thing I love about the cannon. It's just a complete one tap against the eyes and such. That's it. Oh, come on. His hand got in the way. There we go. Oh, what? That looked like it hit. I was about to say. See, that was easy. And I got a stupid fly that's flying around me right now. That's annoying. Let, let me record in peace. You get out of here, boy. I don't have to, I, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna have to kill the darn thing. Anyways, this should be a great fairy, right? Yep. Nice. I love the great fairy music within this game. It sounds very godly like. So now I could be able to get my magic power increased. How did she even get trapped inside of the giant octo anyway? She she get eaten as a fairy just going over the ocean? No, 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 that's what I wanna know. So the lighting looked really weird as such. Your magic power has been increased. Now you have twice as much as what you had before. Which that's actually about to be very helpful for one of the challenges that uh, requires you to glide and all that type of stuff. It's one of the flight challenges. So at least that's done. We got the seven eye reef done. 
uh, not seven Irie, two I reef done. I just gotta go uh, fill out the rest of this map and such. This is about to take a bit. It's gonna take a couple hours and whatnot. I think like two at most, probably, if I'm lucky. But anyways, if you guys did enjoy today's video, why don't you leave a like, subscribe if you guys are all new around here, put a notification bell so you don't miss any new videos just like this one. And also do me one more favor, go to the Gym Nights Productions channel and hit that subscribe button and turn on notification bells as well too, just so you don't miss when I give a nice, good announcement of the anime opening premiere. But anyways, remember that Jesus loves you guys, and I'm Light, and I'll see you guys next time.